Here we go. When you try to fly, it's all you hit a Hi everybody, this is Nick with me, myself, and Droid.com. I'm here with another app review. Today I'm going to be reviewing an app called Tasker. Tasker is an um, application that allows you to automatically adjust uh, settings. Um, actually, it allows you to adjust a whole bunch of stuff. Um, it allows you to adjust settings uh, when you open an application, for instance, or uh, settings for what time of day it is or what your location is um, it allows you to do a whole bunch of things it allows you to change settings uh, for when you open an application for instance so here I have YouTube uh, set so when I open up YouTube now the uh, display uh, timeout changes to 20 minutes the brightness of the display changes to the highest level and the media volume changes to the highest level so no matter what I have the um, the brightness set to let me go ahead and dim this phone um, so you can see it's a low low setting now I'm gonna open up YouTube and you'll see it automatically change the settings YouTube is now open tasker kicks in and it brightens the settings up the media volume changed up to the highest level which you know can come in handy. That's just an example. Other things you can do with Tasker are um, change settings for when you um, are at a certain location. So let's say every time you get in your car um, or every time you get to a certain uh, location you want the Bluetooth to come on. So I have this set to uh, every time I'm in um, a certain spot in Detroit uh, the Bluetooth kicks on because I know that's where I am when I'm in my, uh, you know, in my automobile, and I always have the Bluetooth on in my car. Um, so I have it set to automatically turn the Bluetooth on every time I'm at that location. Um, or other things are here. I have um, the mobile data turned off every night at six o'clock or six thirty for this instance, um, which you know could come in handy. So if I'm you know, sleeping from 6:30 to 2 o'clock in the morning, the um, mobile data turns off, so it doesn't you know eat up my battery while I'm sleeping. So let's go ahead and set up a new task. Um, we'll name this um, Maps. Okay, and we'll set up uh, application, and it'll take a few seconds to load the application. Okay, so here's Maps. We'll click on Maps and then done and then this screen will pop up and allow you to uh, set the task you want to happen when you open the application of maps so we'll click on the plus symbol and let's say we want the GPS to automatically turn on every time we open up maps uh, so we'll click on settings right here and then um, miscellaneous and GPS and we want the GPS to turn on. So uh, done, and then done. So let's go ahead and check and see how this worked. Uh, as you can see here, GPS is currently uh, oops, GPS is currently off. So let's click on the Maps application and. We'll see GPS. Uh, we should see GPS automatically turn on, which it did right there. Okay, so that's just an example of. Um, I haven't set this up yet. <laughs> that's just an example of what you can do uh, with Tasker. There are many, many, many uh, uh, settings you can change. Uh, and events you can uh, have happen when certain things are done on your phone. That's just an example. It is very in-depth and um, it really takes some time to play with and um, get used to. Okay, uh, with this application you can also um, go ahead and browse profiles that are already pre-done for you um, that other users have created. 
Uh, if you click on what I just did there, um, it'll take you to this uh, website where you can uh, see a bunch of pre-done it's loading right now uh, a bunch of pre-done profiles um, that might make it easier for a new user um, to uh, to start with so for you know for instance here's I mean there's quite a few that are available on here um, varying in difficulty but uh, we'll go ahead and do this one right here start of the day with a particular start the day with a particular application clicked on that and it'll take you to this screen where you can uh, download it click download and it'll pop you up with this this uh, uh, menu and you just click on tasker And it says starting download. And then ready for import. So let's get out of here. Click on Tasker. Click menu. Profile data. Import one profile. And that's the one we download right there. So you now see the profile we downloaded. And you can go in and edit this to... Um, act the way you want it to act uh, and change all the settings um, however you want it to react when you open that application. Um, this is just a quick overview of the application itself. The application runs pretty well. Um, it's a little bit lagging sometimes on my older uh, device, the HTC Hero, um, but overall it's not too bad. Um, you can uh, back up, restore, uh, and clear all your profiles and like I said earlier, you can earlier you can import uh, the profiles from the internet that are already pre-done. Um, this application, uh, like I said, does take some time getting used to, um, but there's a uh, pretty good uh, support form behind it on that website I was just at a second ago. Uh, if you do have any questions or need some help with it, uh, it is available to you. Uh, this application uh, is a little bit expensive. It runs six dollars and thirty cents on the Android market and um, uh, it's pretty robust though and if you, it, it does give you uh, like all Android applications uh, 24 hours to try out and uh, see if you like it or not so I suggest um, downloading it and giving it a try and seeing what you can create if you like it keep it and if you don't uh, return it and uh, get your full refund alright thanks for watching this is uh, Nick with me myself and Droid and uh, be sure to check out the website, memyselfandroid.com. And uh, as always, uh, we'll, we'll check you next time. Thanks. Bye.